Hey everybody, the Bong is here ready to give you a brand new Let's Play! Hellfire Saga, a Sonic 3 & Knuckles ROM hack. Said to be a tribute to Sonic, Ghosts and & Goblins, and the Castlevania series. Though not every song in that game is from those games. This game features flashing effects, so oh god, you might want to watch out for that. If you're photosensitive, please use extra caution. You can also be changing the options. Disable, please. I'm looking out for not just myself, but you peeps as well. So yeah, this was recommended to me an awful lot back in the day. And well, I figure now would be a good time to finally play it. What other options do we have? Uh, let's just try normal mode. I don't think we need to go to assist mode. But yeah, for like a ROM hack of Sonic 3 and Knuckles, this is very high rent. Alright, let's jump right in. Forest of Decay. Alright, so we're getting started with this game, and the first level has Act Razor music. So another thing you'll notice right away, instead of having a rain counter, you actually have red rings that serve as your HP. So that's helpful, I guess. Also very helpful at getting a shield right away. Graphics? At least the uh, backgrounds are kind of average. The tall sets look okay. Just hopefully it doesn't get too samey afterwards. Nice effects with the foreground, though. Go ahead and get up here. Oh, I have the water shield now. Oh, did I find a spring? I didn't even know that was there. It doesn't really do anything for me. All right. Oh wait, it's Arthur. Oh, lost my shield immediately. Oh, do attack pattern. Okay, so I can't just stay above him because of the torch. Dead. Boss theme from, like, Castlevania on X68000. Look, that's it. Where am I? How did I get here? Hmm. All I remember is a bright flash. Uh, no you don't, because flashing is turned off. And then... Everything was gone. And now I'm here. Hello. Not another step, mortal. I am Gloam Glozer, the Guardian of the Gates. And you, you have been disturbing my forest. How reckless. Go no further, peasant. Once you enter the deep woods, you're completely doomed. Doomed, I say. This is my domain, and I'll be watching. Away. Well, at least now I know where I should be going. Oh, they don't even give you, like, a full ring of health. You have to get a, quite a few of them. Oh! Oh, well. Guess no way to test the new ice shield. It's gone now. 
That lasted a whole one second. Okay. Looks like we still got... We got some pretty, uh, intricate platforming right at the very first level, but at least there's plenty of checkpoints. Oh! I thought I was gonna do something special when I crouched. Oh, it's the- those pigs! Got it. I know, I was about to die, too. This is playing as secret routes. Okay, pausing just brings up that menu. I thought there was gonna be like some kind of inventory system. I'll go up. Looks like he could go down. Oh my god, why does the ice shield get... Why is that the one shield I get, which caused me to get hit almost immediately? And of course it's bats that are gonna give me a hard time in this. I'm gonna do a little tab, there we go. I didn't want to get shot. Oh, I couldn't jump when I was wedged with a shield. Okay, good, they do come back. Whoa, whoa, careful. Would like to keep the shield as long as possible. For obvious reasons. Yeah, I don't see what what else this shield does other than just save me a hit. Oh god, another boss. Oh god, these I gotta dodge axes. And there's no way of knowing where they're gonna come from until they show up on screen. So there's a dragon just shoots Fleeman. That was only stage one, by the way. Gotta guess that this game is on limited lives, because there's no lives counter here. Forest of Decay, Stage 2. Ah, speaking of Flea Men. Most of them to show up. Way easier to deal with in this game. Oh, music from Super Castlevania 4. Wait. What? Am I supposed to go back? Oh yeah, this has changed now. I always like these little, little things. Just like, small changes that could just affect your route through the level. Has it been changed again? Oh, it just... Oh, wow. It's a bad time to jump there. Yeah, it looks like your route just keeps changing. Like, when you go left to right, and then vice versa, you're constantly having to go back where you came. 
can make things a little confusing. Like, you just think you're going backwards, but instead you're going forwards. Okay, I got lucky there. Oh, they don't even let you pick up the health rings if you were already in max. I guess that's a good quality of life thing. So that you're not accidentally getting all the health. And then you have nothing to grab when you actually do take a hit. These item boxes are... You still get them. Why is it beeping? Did I... Did a bird just show up... Like, right where I was, and I didn't know? That's mean. That is straight booty right there. Oh, come on. What's up with the hitboxes on those birds? It's not just bats, but it's usually just flying enemies in video games in general. Way out where? What the hell is that supposed to be? It's like some kind of doll. I feel like that was based on some uh, fan fiction or OC content. Wait, OC content? That's just OCC then! <laughs> Silly bonga. You need to keep up with the deviant arts. This is such a weird level. Oh, hey, it's Astroth. Oh! Nice of the game to warn me where uh, hazards are. Like, genuinely this time. Oh, this guy can turn around on a dime. So hyper-aggression is not the best approach to take. Oh, one HP in a dream. Why is everything upside down? Oh, together? Oh no! I'm upside down now. Can't seem to do much to him when he's got that shield. Okay, that was lame. Oh god, the momentum. Up! Oh, I'm dead. Where? How far back was this? Okay, at least I can get two hits on him. Ah, oh, before he puts the shield up. Oh, bullshit. And you can't duck that either. Got him. I don't even know why I'm spinning that sign. I don't think it's doing anything for me in this hack. Yeah, if this does have infinite lives, that's honestly a good thing, because what's the point of lives in this? That's familiar. How dare you defy my orders! You! I finally found you! What happened to my world? Where are my friends? Answer me! What are you talking about? 
And you have the gall to yell at me? I am the guardian. Now you've crossed the line. No mercy! Why is it Mickey Mouse? I guess I just have to hit this boss directly. Grand friend? Okay, I can't really reach this boss easily. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to stand still with the tombstones. Oh, that's gonna make things really slow. I bet if I had, like, a, a lightning shield... I'd be able to hit him way more often. As far as the Mickey Mouse phase, like, that's gonna be tricky to dodge. Like, the Tombstone attack, not so much. Yeah, cause look, how do you avoid that? Right now, that's the only one I find the hardest to dodge. Oh, oh, careful. Oh, this attack would be hard to dodge too, like those crosses, but no. Hey! Back here. Oh no. Being spun. Enough. Death. Oh no. It's him. Did you not hear what I said, Bloom? But we shouldn't let a mortal in. That's what the rules say. Have you already forgotten who's in charge? No, sir. Precisely. How long has it been since we've been a seen a mortal? Descend this far? What a fascinating specimen. I want myself a show. Let him into the city. Understood. Don't say I haven't warned you. Out of my sight. Now! Okay. Well, at least I beat that boss on the first try. I thought I was gonna get my ass handed to me. But it hardly used the, uh, Mickey Mouse attack. Sin City. This is the closest you'll get to a casino level. Oh, hey, Rouge. Rouge is dead. Sorry, furries. It had to be done. I think this is supposed to be, like, Hydro City Zone, but hell. Whoa! Oh, hey, it's Ghost Rider. I'm guessing those hearts would hurt me. You know, this... I think what's gonna make this level hard is just having a hard time parsing what's a platform and what isn't. You got lucky, Rouge. This time. It's 
As far as those spear soldiers go... Okay, you gotta get on the top of the head. The hitbox is so tiny because it's mostly shield. Right, what's this? Oh, it's those faces from uh, Bloodlines. So I have to attack the heart? Okay, I guess that's all I gotta do. Looks like you only get like maybe three hits. This attack is piss easy to avoid. Somehow I thought I was gonna get hit and then I eat my own words. Like I've eaten them enough as is. Portrait of Ruin? Oh, I have to go through, like, the green pentagrams to bring that down. What happens if I hit it again? Does it go back up? No. I think that's just perma-activated. I'm okay with that. So I don't have to go back there. Did I get- no, oh, I didn't get enough speed. Well, so far this hack's not too bad. Like, it's accessible to an extent. Oh, you can defeat the skeletons before they explode. That's good to know. Well, maybe I was just supposed to hit the blocks? In any case, we're zooming. Is it gonna put a bottomless pit there? I don't think we've seen any bottomless pits so far yet. Uh oh. Oh, but there is drowning! Wait! How did I die instantly? Are there, like, evil, uh, devices? Okay, at least there's a shield there. Maybe I shouldn't pull any of them. Or maybe you just drown instantly as opposed to, like, having a long period of time since it's blood. Could be it. That's why they wanted you to get the shield. Oh, oh. Okay, at least we made it past that part. Oh, hey, it's Death. Hello, mortal. I am Death. Welcome to the capital of Sin. Your first venture into hell proper. Why didn't you save me? What do you want? Save you? Don't be absurd. You're not just a competent fighter. You're also funny. I like you more every minute. I have an array of challengers lined up for you. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Let's see how you fare. Oh. Oh god, they're like bombs. Okay, 
Okay, at least you can bait where it goes. Tried to jump there, it didn't work. Sadly, I lost my shield, but at least I'm still in it. Oh god, it bounces off the wall. I can make things trippy. One more hits does this uh, creature need? Oh, that missed my chance. This one could take a while. Ah, shit, that hit me anyway. That's rude. Finally! Okay, that was all stage one. Sin City stage two. I remember Sin City. That movie with uh, Bruce Willis and Jessica Alba in it. I remember seeing that theater. It was, it was okay. For what it was. I don't usually like to see a lot of movies, but that was one I did see. That's one I did. That was pretty good. Oh! Oh, it takes a ring. That's rude. Drainage system status blood level. So it's at one right now. Okay. So you can change that at on the fly, I guess? Hmm. I don't know if I actually dealt with it without taking more damage. Dang, and I already had eye brains at the time. See, if I had that shield... ...for the previous boss... ...it would have gone a lot faster. You have no idea. I can't stop doing that. It seems like every time I jump, there's like one of those grabby things that make you go fast. Maybe I'll just ignore the hands. We're going fighting them. I think I want to keep the lightning shield. Oh, well, I guess I don't have it anymore. I, that's, that may not even be a shield. Yeah, it wasn't. It was just a ring. I was not supposed to know there were spikes there. So now it's at level 3. Okay. Okay, don't do that again. Oh god, I'm all the way back here. Oh, normally you're supposed to push this. Wait, wasn't the electro shield back there? Can I just get it back? Oh yes, I can. I'll just do that. <laughs> I don't even need to push the thing. Oh, 
Alright, this track's good. I don't know where that's from, though. Oh my god, it was another Electro Shield. So in getting that one, I lost it immediately. Good job, Bozo. And by Bozo, I mean whoever put those spikes there. It wasn't me, the guy that got hit by him. Oh god, that was right near the checkpoint too, for god's sake. Salt in the wound. Oh hey, it's red armor. Looks like he's trying to do the chicken dance. Da 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 Oh god, that goes the full way. Okay, I see what I need to avoid. The flames in the back are fine. God, it does like a different pattern every time. I can't prepare for that. Because every single attack he did was different. Also, a pain in the ass, you can only hit him once. Man, wish I still had that lightning shield. Yeah, it's just like the small flames in the- Oh, for God's sake, I can't see it very well. Not a fan that I can only hit him once and then he just attacks. Let me attack him more times, gang. Okay, it looks like he only has three patterns. The second one is just ass. Oh, I jumped too late. I could have avoided it there. Death, that's a problem. Might have to go into save states at this point. Oh, never mind. We didn't get to see the bullshit pattern again. Oh! I can see, like, uh, how the drowning system works. In case you haven't noticed, your HP was. My HP was gradually decreasing. Oh, it takes a while for all that blood to go back down. Oh, I thought I was finished. Ah, that's what you gotta do. Wait. What? Oh no, I see what I gotta do. I gotta... Do I gotta put it back? Oh shit. Yeah, look how much it's going down. I don't know if it recovers. 
If you, uh, get back out of the blood. Yeah, I see what I gotta do. I gotta push this a bit. So I can get over here. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! It- The momentum was just constantly pushing me into those springs. Oh, this is hot garbage. Okay, at least it worked this time. And I made it over here. Oh, I thought this was going to be an enemy from Ball 3D. Oh, that basic mix. <laughs> okay, that was funny. It just knocks you right off. Oh, I can't hit it immediately? That's not fair. How dare I n not be allowed to get a cheap shot in? Oh my god, I missed the hook. I hit jump, game! Did I win already? Oh, okay. Cool. It's stage three. Oh, do we face death himself? You're still here. I expected you to be long gone by now. I'm impressed. You're a real warrior. You provided me with some good entertainment. But, I don't have anything more for you here. What do you mean? You've reached the end of the line, my friend. I'll make this quick. I have other things to do. Okay, at least the sides are easy to avoid. So I think Spin Dash is the way to go against death. Uh oh. Okay, this part might be ass though. Oh, he's got a lot of HP. Oh! Did I beat him already? There's no way. Oh, no, no, get the checkpoint, get the checkpoint. Yeah, it looks like there's a round two. Okay, at least it gave me health back. I 
How do you hit him? Spring? You know what he almost looks like when he's that large? He reminds me of a boss in Gaiares. Even though it, there's no boss in Gaiares that is this. But it was like a large ass sprite. Too bad you don't get all your rings back. How do you avoid that attack then? Maybe I gotta jump right away? Okay, I think jumping right away helps. Oh. No. It's knocking me into the water. I didn't get a spring. Okay, that time it actually hurt me quite a bit. Okay, I don't know how you're supposed to dodge that. Huh? Oh, I went right into it like a dumbass. I think we're in rewind and save state territory. So we're so close to the end, I think. Oh, the freaking rings again. I thought I was going to go back to the sides. time in this phase two, I think. Oh man, I was actually close. I needed to move more to the right. See, at least this attack is easy. The rest of it, not so much. Oh my god, can I like dodge that attack on the first try once? Can you let me game? I've been so good, as I like to think I am, despite the fact I'm in hell. Is it over? I'm still able to move. Oh no, I think it is over. I think? Is it over though? Malicious glance. No, it's not over. You can go to Axe Armors. And Symphony of the Night music. What else could be waiting for me now that death is gone? I guess Satan? Satan is usually the safe bet. Oh my god. Okay, I thought I was gonna get hit by that axe. I believed it for a moment. Oh 
Oh god, they even got archer enemies now. It seems they only shoot upper left or upper right. It's actually manageable. Because usually, for some reason, they have the high ground. I guess that's to punish people that jump at the bad time. As long as you know what you're doing, that won't be you. I just got got by the flame cannons. What the hell is this guy? Like, a, is that kind of mad scientist? Oh my god. I hate this guy's pattern already. Especially when he throws like so many red potions at once. Oh! I thought we both died. How could I think of something so silly as that? Like evil footing? Or equal footing? Hell no. Yeah, sometimes he only just throws one. I'm starting to think spin dashing might be better against this fiend as well. Never mind. Turns out he was a bitch after all. Works for me. Oh, I can just get him around the feet. Where are these armors supposed to be from? The, like the archer, I mean. It doesn't look like a Castlevania enemy. Yeah, that was close. Oh, if there's a low ceiling, that archer could be dangerous. Oh wow, that actually, I, actually did hit me. Okay, don't do the spin dash there again. Lessons have been learned. Um, okay, at least I made it to a checkpoint. Cerberus? No, werewolf! I guess he warns you when he's gonna attack or slide. Which is, well, also an attack. Oh, one HP in a dream again. What do you mean that was just another mid-boss? What the hell? Oh, it's rising. That was a bad time to jump, wasn't it? Well, lesson learned. Maybe Malicious Glance is all just one stage and that's it. We're giving you that many mid bosses. That climb sequence. I think I should have gotten that ring there, but. Oh god, they're putting some goodies there to tease me. I'm dead. No, it just stops. But I'm in a worse situation than I was before. Okay, not so bad. Got a checkpoint now. 
<laughs> okay, that was poor, horribly timed. That was an oopsie of the oopsiest proportions. Hmm. Looking like a secret down there. It wants me to believe I can push that. Oh, maybe... No, oh, no, no. Maybe you gotta go through here. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. That's better. I can go into this part with more health. Now what? Shaft? Hello, Sonic. Welcome to Devil's Castle. How do you know my name? My master knows a lot about your kind. I've been watching you for a while now. Your fighting prowess is quite admirable. However, I've been ordered to stop you. Prepare for an onslaught. Oh, this guy? Okay, I just seem to always be near where the fireball is gonna be. I have to hit the armor next. God's sake. Oh my god! Okay, maybe don't do that. I just gotta find where on the torso is safe to hit. Okay, at least he doesn't repeat the dialogue again. Okay, I think the fireball is always going to be where I'm currently too. So just bait it. Ace 3. Whoa! It shoots dick fire! Is that it? What did I think it was gonna be all one stage? Of course it wouldn't be. Alright, Malicious Glance 2. Where is this from? Oh, Aria of Sorrow. It's actually a good rendition of that song. Personally, I find Aria of Sorrow is a game I actually recommend more than Symphony of the Night. Back then, I thought it was like... It was definitely Symphony of the Night was better. But over time, it has certainly changed. Where I think Aria Sorrow is better. But they're both really good. Oh, this is gonna be disorienting as hell. And now we got Gravity Man gimmick again. At least the level design for Sonic games for at least this hack has been solid. Because it could be pretty easy to ruin. The hell? Where are you supposed to hit this thing? A tail? Is it the tail? Oh god, it's Moldorm. I'm facing Moldorm. 
in a Sanic game. Only the hitbox was in hot trash. I'm getting better at it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, stop putting me upside down. I hate that shit. Oh, good. That enemy is the worst. Because you better hope you're at the right spot or you're getting tagged by the orbs, and it's not a good time. Give me that, please. Whee! Oh, okay, that was a bad idea. Just keep going down farther and farther into this abyss. How far down does this go? At this point, Sonic will just reach China or Australia. Oh! Bloodline Smith boss. Oh, is that the only time you can hit this guy? Okay, it looks like I have to bait an axe swing. And then he jumps. Usually to where you're to. And then you can tag him. Oh, hey, hello, I have... You know I have a friend? Oh, I can only get him when he launches the arm. Oh, for God's sake. I gotta get the timing right. Or that's gonna happen, and then you just you get grabbed and you die. I don't wanna do this. these two fights again. Okay, you can just get under the fist. Maybe this has to be the last world. I mean, where else can you go outside of hell? The like Kim Pender's house? <laughs> At least that's what a Sonic fan would definitely say. I mean, surely that'll get me my club for this video. Can somebody in the comment section let me know what the ice shield is really supposed to do? Or is this really all it is? Just one free hit. It has no special powers. Because if it didn't have any special powers, just use like the... The regular shield that was in the other Sonic games. Just, just do that. I can't wait to get into a level where I don't have to worry about inverting the gravity every time. And sometimes you're only doing it for a few seconds, like what's the point? Like, 
you're inverting the gravity just to revert it, like maybe three seconds later if you're speedrunner of this, this hack. You gonna fight me now, Shaft? Of course not, because you're a cowardly bitch! Oh, God, Snipe! It's just the second boss from Ghouls and Ghosts. I'm trying to see a pattern here. Oh. Okay, getting cornered is a bad idea. Oh, that's it. Okay. Oh, well, this must be the last level then. Fighting fight Shaft. So my calculations were true. Your power is exceptional. I don't believe I can stop you. But I can still delay you. If it means I can buy my master more time, I'll gladly face my demise. Oh, yeah, you're not the last boss then. Hey, this shouldn't be how it ends. I'm gonna save the world. I'm gonna save my friends. And I'm gonna save you. Just let me through, please. No, this is not an option. I swore an oath to my master. Goodbye, Sonic. It was an honor. What? Really? The Mecha Sonic? Oh, I missed the timing there. God, how do you deal with that attack? Because sometimes it goes high and other times it goes low. Off. I'm gonna have to start spin dashing. Ready for round two? Alright, don't do that. How do you even hit him? Okay, for that first ground attack, there's no tell. Do you have to do both phases again? I think you do. Great. Alright, I'll try this fight again, but this time I'm at full health.
Oh god, like you I was kinda hoping that I hit him again. It's going a little bit better. Really, I miss him each time? Got him. What? Another phase? No, this time it is shaft. Just gotta deal with the evil orbs now. Master, I'm sorry. Oh, now what? Devil's Descent? Oh, this does not have a stage number. Hello. Eggman! I knew you'd come. I knew it. Even if I was expecting you. Much later than this. What are you doing here? I'm here to take over the world. What else? After countless defeats at your hands, I felt... Humiliated. Destroyed. I had to do something. In my desperation, I made a deal with the devil. He gave me the throne of hell, imprisoning all of your friends. And I'm the one who's going to rule it all. You're not going to get away with it. Oh, I'm not going to get away with it? I'm going to get away with it in style. This machine embodies the power of the devil himself. Infused with my brilliant mind. Even though it's not ready yet, I'll show you what it can do. Say your prayers, Hedgehog. Alright, it's a giant cobra head. Alright, at least its weak spot is shown. Nice animation on this uh, beast, by the way. It's hard to tell when it's gonna, like, lurch out and attack you. Oh! How does it know the laser eyes are coming? Okay, maybe when it rears us all, all the way up. Wait. This can't be it already. Okay, at least I got more health. Oh, wow. Demon Eggman. How'd he hit him? Oh, you have to wait for the big, uh, fuck you sign to happen.
At least your dash can be used to uh, evade faster. Oh, Eggman trying to give me the clap. Are the rockets again? Oh, they're homing, so they're missiles, not rockets. What I don't like about this attack is because you have a little bit of inertia. So this is an imaginative fight, I will give it that. Oh, I gotta deal with this and the missiles. That was close. Oh, the hands get you on the way back. That's mean. So you gotta dodge two different attacks at once. Like, it would be one thing if it was just the clap, then the missiles, and then, like, the wind slashes. But no, you gotta deal with a lot of it at once. And on top of that, you you only get like get to hit the boss like maybe once every what two or three minutes, maybe longer if the pattern goes well beyond what you're doing. So it's been hit three times, and it's still going. It's not giving me high hopes, to be honest. On this being an exciting boss fight. Especially with like how long you gotta wait before you can hit it again. Plus a lot of these like when it does do the attack only once. Like, I've already dodged it several times. Like, why are we going through all these motions again? Like, this would be a lot more engaging if the whole gimmick was don't get hit for as long as possible and you get closer to Egg Demon. And if you get hit, you get sent farther back. It would give every cycle a bit more urgency, because you have to not get hit. Right now, the only penalty for getting hit is getting closer to death. So I think this could have been done a little bit better. Are we done? I can't move. Yeah, I think it just needs to be hit four or five times. Yeah! How could it end like this? I was so close. You were close, but not close enough. I give you everything. My army, my power. And yet you still failed. You're pathetic. Oh god, no! Give me another chance. No, you've had your chance. It was nice knowing you, fool. These are the people who stayed with us till the end. They are the ones who have made this game possible. Oh, it just gets the credits? I wonder if you get, like, an extended ending if you beat the game on Maniac. I'm sure it's on YouTube. Oh, these are interactive credits. 
Okay. So that's it. That's a uh, Hellfire Saga for the uh, Sega Genesis, a uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles ROM hack. They made a game fun the only way they knew how by making it shorter than the actual Sonic 3 and Knuckles and just putting a lot more stuff in it. Okay, so I guess I gotta look everywhere for the other boxes. So you can get the rest of the credits. They made it a level. So you get to see who was involved in what. It releases enemies, but they can't kill you at least. Imagine if you could die in the credits level. Oh, we've added some uh, graphics to it. Okay, that's a nice touch. You can tell they pulled no punches and uh, at least making this hat good. Writing by Pixel Cat, Hot Milk, and Epsilon Dub Bull. Okay, at least there's a threshold how far you can go. Find all monitors. Oh, I didn't find them all yet. So you can, like, get the credits in a different order. Oh, hey, there's Tails. Oh, it's good to know that the people that weren't on the team anymore still got thanked. That's a nice touch as well. So yeah, would I recommend this hack? I would say yes. Even though I'm not big on Sonic games, this one was done really well. Like, just the amount of love they put into it. You, you can tell it was as fan-gamey as it gets. But it wasn't in the way where the level design was ass. At least they designed it in a way that'd be like, okay, we gotta treat it like it's an actual Sonic game. Where there's more than one way to get through the end of the stage. And like, if you're just gonna like take your time or if you're gonna bum rush it, at least both ways work. Oh wait, there was something in Kid Chameleon? I wonder what was in Kid Chameleon, I didn't even notice. Splatterhouse 2, Demon's Crest, Sparkster 2, Castle Illusion, G.S. Mikami, Omori, Galarez, or Gaiarez, Adventures of Batman and Robin, Contra Hardcore? Oh, details can be found in the sound test if you want to know like where the tracks are from. But yeah, this final version was out in 2023. So it's not a very old hack by any means. See you next game. Level select unlocked. All right, so there's some replay value. Like, hey, what if you wanted to like go back to the levels you've done? And now the, the game lets you. You just have to beat the game first. Alright, let's see what I'll, what it looks like now. Hey, what if we replay the game again with flashing enabled? No, I'm not insane. Oh, it's in continue now. If I go to sound test, how does it look? Oh, it even tells you where it's from. 
Oh, this was from Rusty. It's a PC-98 game. I wouldn't mind trying to get PC-98 games working. I've had, like, one working, which was, like, a, a Gradius 2 bootleg. Or maybe one of these days I will get PC-98 and PC-88 games going. Add more games to the potential that I can play. Maybe there's too much already. Oh, Dana! That's another game I want to check out. Okay, this one's an original track. Oh, Dragon's Fury, that's a pinball game. That's Doom Eternal? No, oh, this track's cool. They've done pretty well. I get out of sound test. You can turn off the cinematic camera. I guess it was just for the cutscenes. Alright, if I go to continue, what does it look like? Does it just go straight to level select? Okay, you can! You can even see the credits, too. And you can change the photo sensitivity. Alright, so I think that's gonna do it for Hellfire Saga. I hope you all enjoyed it. I know I did, surprisingly. But this is the Bonga signing off saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I shall see you next time.